Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this problem related to 10th grade coordinate geometry. ABCD is a rectangle with A coordinates as minus 1 comma 2, B 3 comma 7 and AB is to BC is 4 is to 3. If P is the center of the rectangle, then the distance of P from each corner is equals to how much? Now we have been given a rectangle ABCD. We know the coordinates of A and B. We need to calculate the distance of P, the center of the rectangle, to each vertex that is A, B, C and D. First and foremost, we know that ABCD is a rectangle and we know in rectangle the diagonals bisect each other and also the diagonals are equal. Therefore, AP equals to PB equals to PC equals to PD, all of them are equal. Also, we have been given A coordinates and B coordinates. So, we can easily use the distance formula and calculate what is AB. Now, how can we write AB by leveraging the distance AB? For that, we have been supplied extra condition that AB by BC equals to 4 is to 3. AB by BC equals to 4 is to 3. Let's take AB as 4x and BC as 3x. Then what will be AC? AC will be 5x because we have in rectangle all the angles are 90 degrees. By applying Pythagoras theorem, we know that AC equals to square root of AB square plus BC square which is 5x. Now let's find out what is AP. AP is half of AC that is half of 5x because just now we said AC is 5x by Pythagoras theorem. But what is x? Let's calculate AC once again for clarity. AC is square root of AB square plus BC square that is square root of 4x whole square plus 3x whole square that is 5x. But what is x? x is nothing but AB by 4. The given information is there in AB. So we should write our problem in such a way that we direct it towards AB. It becomes half into 5 into AB by 4, which is 5 by 8 into AB. Now, the problem is pretty simple because you can easily calculate the distance of AB by using distance formula. So, let's calculate the distance between A and B. Then we can come back and multiply that with 5 by 8 to give the value of AB. Now, what is the distance between AB? For that, we'll be using distance formula. Square root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square. So, AB equals to square root of 3 plus 1 whole square plus 7 minus 2 whole square, which is equals to square root of 4 square plus 5 square, which is square root of 16 plus 25. And that is equals to square root of 41. Once we know AB equals to square root of 41, immediately we know the answer we are looking for is 5 by 8 into square root of 41. Because AP is 5 by 8 times of AB, that is 5 by 8 square root of 41. 